In this video, we're going to have a look at adding a box gutter to the underside of the roof at the end here, because traditionally or typically what we would see is it attached to the actual top of a wall on a building like this um, underneath the roof structure. But the existing profiles that we have um, don't really do that. So what we want to do is look at it in section or in elevation on the side make some notes of the thickness of the roof here and then the distance back to the wall by there. Okay, so once you've made a note of those, what you're going to want to do then is go to File, New and Family. Okay, and you are then going to find the profile. So in this one, it's metric profile and you would then open. And I'm just going to cancel that because I've already done so. Now, starting, imagine this cross here is that top point of the roof. So you come down the thickness of the roof and then across back to the wall. And then you start your profile using the line commands. I've just done a simple 300 square and made the material three millimeters thick. OK, so what you want to do then is draw that out and then do file and save as a family okay and save it in the correct directory for the profiles and the roofs okay and i will just save there and then you can load that into the project once you've done that we can now go to the 3d view and we now want to go to the roof command gutter. OK, we will edit the type. And what we want to do is we've got standard by here. We could give it a name. So we'll just call this box gutter. Say OK, change the profile to your steel box gutter that you've just created and the material we'll want to edit as well to um, probably something more along the lines of what should be there. Aluminium we'll go for on this one. All right. And say OK. And we're now ready to actually add a gutter. So click on that top line and there is our box guttering running along the side of the building attached where it should be. All right, if you uh, enjoyed the videos and find this helpful, please don't forget to like and subscribe as it really does help with the channel growth. Thank you.